Now, Honorable Justice Lewis Alago of the Federal High Court seating in Lagos has directed the state government and her agencies to hold their proposed mass vaccination on Saturday for students and residents of the state if there is no written consent by the beneficiaries. According to the presiding judge, there must be a written consent by the beneficiaries of the proposed vaccination before it can proceed. Now, lead counsel to the plaintiff, Mobishala Odumegu, who filed the petition in an interview with journalists, said the purpose of filing the motion is to give the residents of the state the right to freedom of choice. In the suit filed by the Equity Initiatives International, you know, against Lagos State Government and the other agencies of the Lagos State Government, what the court has pronounced, the Federal High Court, is to halt the proposed mass vaccination as opposed to start on Saturday. And this vaccination has been halted pending the dissemination of the motion of notice that has been filed. So the court has made the order that there should be a moratorium, a hold in a nutshell, I'm paraphrasing, you know, on this planned mass vaccination of children and residents of Lagos State. If there is no consent, you know, written consent by the parents, by the guardians. So everything is on hold. Status quo definitely must be maintained by all the parties till 9th December 2024. But because it's very important, if something is going to be put inside your body, you should consent. Number one, it cannot be forced. Number two, you must give informed consent. You know the contents, you know, of what is going to be put in your body. It is a question of right to life. So those issues on the merits are still going to be decided. But our contention is that these are the things that touch on the lives of people, their privacy, because you're putting something in their body, their dignity, and then their freedom from discrimination if they don't take it. So that's why we're... Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.